An average price point in our office is between, I would say, 20 and $60,000. Today, I'm gonna to take you through some of my work on some of your favorite reality stars and beautiful people. I believe patients seek me out not only for my artistic ability in understanding how someone should look, but I think I take it one step further in understanding the patient's personality and being able to capture that in their smile. So this is Kyle Richards from Housewives of Beverly Hills. She actually messaged me on Instagram, which is how we found her. She came in and she had great teeth, but she didn't show her teeth. And so one of the biggest things for her was to be able to smile without having to strain. And it was one of the cases that probably is one of the most recognized mouths that I've done because everybody noticed after she told them that she had her teeth done, she didn't used to show her teeth before because her lips covered them. So when I built her teeth out and made them bigger, all of a sudden she showed her teeth and it made such a dramatic difference to her entire face and that was really the biggest thing with her. The first time I really felt like I had achieved my goals in becoming the cosmetic dentist to the stars was when I had bought my New York office and opened up Dubai and had patients that were scheduled months in advance. As soon as you have a waiting list, you start to get that, okay, yes, what I believe in my mind is now true. Yeah, so Vinny as well messaged me on Instagram. It's a very common way of interacting with patients today. I think everybody on his sh original show, Jersey Shore, had their teeth done. Vinny was the last, and he wanted a, s a certain look to his smile, but he wanted it to look natural. I think he had seen some of his cast members have not such a good outcome, and was very paranoid about having fake looking teeth. So we spent a lot of time just going through what to expect and what not to expect. And then finally he pulled the trigger and uh, we were able to really recreate his smile in a better version of himself. Porcelain veneers is, is basically redesigning your smile with thin wafers of, of porcelain that replicate the natural tooth. And it essentially recreates an entirely new smile if done well. We have all of our ceramics in-house. They're some of the most talented ceramics in the world. They're all under one roof, whether it's in Dubai, New York, or LA. You know, I think people are coming at the end of the day for the design part, which is the individual doctors that are in our group. We have a very select view on how people should look, and, and we're all very, very talented doctors. So. I think those things combine is why people seek us out. Cosmetic dentistry can range anywhere from $500 per tooth to we charge $4,000 per tooth. It really depends on where you're getting it, who's performing it, what materials they're using, who their lab is. I mean, there are a lot of different factors that dictate price. Ramona had been a patient of our practice just doing general dentistry over 10, 15 years ago. And I had talked to her then about doing veneers and she was very big on not looking done, not having anything done, aging gracefully. She messaged me and, and actually called me at the office and said, you know, I went to a dentist in LA. He said I had cavities in my front teeth. I think it's time that we actually do the porcelain veneers. So, you know, she has very signature style to her teeth. You can see some of her teeth are, are turned and, and that gives her certain characteristics. So it was about replicating that, taking out the cavities and things like that, but making her look very similar to when she came in. Anytime you touch anyone and you change the way they look, especially in your mouth, which is one of the most sensitive parts of your body, there's an adaptation where they're not sure if they love it, they're not sure if they chose the right color until they heal and they've lived with it and they've gotten their first compliment. When somebody says to them, wow, you look great, that's when it registers like, wow, I really, had an amazing thing done for myself. Obviously any good work, whether it's plastic surgery, cosmetic dentistry, you know, everyone has their aesthetic, but to me, good work goes unnoticed. People may say you look great, but they can't put their finger on exactly what you had done.